Hello everyone! Today I'm going to show you the mistakes I found in the movie Boss Baby Family Business. The Templeton brothers have become adults and drifted away from each other, but a new boss baby with a cutting-edge approach is about to bring them together again and inspire a new family business. We believe this compilation does not carry with it any spoilers, so sit back and relax. Here are 31 mistakes that our scrutinizers at Movie House observed. To begin with, as we zoom in on the now grown Ted and Boss Baby, notice how he is on a call but there is no telephone wire that can be seen. Well, that's absurd because we see the cable in the very next shot. Likewise in this shot, as Tim gets to feel the sting of growing up, notice how he places the soda bottle after his lava trick fails to impress Tabitha. In the very next shot, as Tabitha moves away, the orientation of the bottle has changed. Over here, notice how Tim places the telephone on the table and look at its wire hanging from the table. In the following shot, the toy phone appears to have been kept away on the table with no wires dangling out whatsoever. Weird, don't you think? In this shot, as Uncle Ted makes his iconic entrance into the home, notice how the entire house is reflecting on his sunglasses. However, the reflection does not include Tim's face that has been sticking against the window at the time. Notice Uncle Ted's white watch dial as he hands a wad of cash to Tabitha. In the following shot where Tim makes the revelation about Tina to Ted, the color on the watch dial is black. We get it, Uncle Ted is rich, but is he carry multiple watches rich? Also over here, notice the position of the pacifier and see how it changes positions. Tim puts up the pacifier in a different way, but the next shot he is holding it in another way. And we have yet another positioning error. Notice how Tina in this shot is standing in the middle of the table, but in the next shot her position has changed. Again, watch closely as to how Ted's hand displaces the jar near the corner of the table. And as the brothers begin snatching the potion from each other, the jar appears to have moved. Here is a classic camera angle discrepancy. Notice how from this angle of the shot, Tim has already closed the door. But in the very next shot, we can see that he has not crossed it yet. Perhaps the production team on the studio could hire someone from us at Movie House. Over here, notice where the bottle falls near Tim. In the following shot from above, it appears to have moved closer to Tim. Maybe it just rolled over. Also, coming back to the Baby Corpse new formula scene, notice how Tim's t-shirt is blank with nothing printed on it. Later, we see a Hot Wheels logo printed on the t-shirt. And here we go again with a positioning mistake. Look at the fruits on the plate. Enough said. While many positioning mistakes can be excusable, we believe that big continuity mistakes have to be condemned. We're just kidding, guys. Anyway, here's a big continuity error. In this shot, we see the boss baby throwing the apple towards the back. And in the following shot, someone appears to have mysteriously kept the apple on the plate. Notice the paint cans over here. Clearly, the boss baby topples them and at least one of them, as you can see, has to have fallen towards their front. But in the very next close-up shot, the paint cans have disappeared. Over here, notice how the initial viewpoint, the snow is uneven, but in the following shot, it looks plain. And yet another continuity mistake. Notice how the sticks in the glue baby's hand change color, and that's another continuity mistake there. The red and blue colored sticks is what we're pointing to. In this scene, notice how the boss baby drops these candles. Well, they disappear in the following shot where we see the floor. Look how the teeth on the table have disappeared when the camera angle changes. In this scene, look at the baby near the dumbbells. Notice how there is no graffiti drawn on the ground near the baby. But a shot later, the floor art appears to have come out of nowhere. Over here, notice how the baby with the white uniform is standing at the second stair below that of the boss baby. But in the very next shot, he's standing on the next stair below the boss baby. Chances are that he may have crawled up in the background. Again in this same scene, did you notice the baby standing on the stair below the money bucket? Well, he disappears in the next shot. Did the baby in white push him away? Over here, notice the baby hexagon pods. We will call it that for now. Near and around Armstrong. 
while the hexagon pods next to his left leg disappear in the subsequent shot. Fast forward and over here we have yet another positioning mistake. And this time it's around the yellow glass near Grandpa's plate. Look how it has changed position over shots. Now this might be a grave error. Notice how Tabitha disappears entirely. Clearly she was between Tim and Tina, but later as Tina looks over at Tim, Tabitha has vanished. And in the same Tabitha disappearance shot, we see two glasses appearing near Tim from out of nowhere. That's weird. Tabitha's disappearing and two glasses appearing? Yikes. In this shot, notice how the page falls on the blank side up from Tabitha's hands. But in the very next shot, it's the other side up. Looks like some crews at the animation department got careless at this point while making the film. Notice how there isn't any magnifying glass and paint jars behind the baby. Well, they come up in the next shot. And you guessed it right, from out of nowhere. And here's another disappearing act. Notice that bag he's dropped on the floor as Armstrong begins to chase them. Well, it disappears on subsequent team. Folks, this error is from a shot in the trailer that somehow did not make it into the final cut of the film. And it's nothing complicated. It's just that the headphone on Tim's right ear disappears. And last but not least, notice how Tina has changed in these two iterations, as you can see. Some may wonder why the change. And to counter that, others may opine change is good. Nonetheless, it exists. And we are here to point that out. We hope that, as we speak, the production team at DreamWorks is brainstorming around rolling out a sequel to Boss Baby. Let's wait and see. Meanwhile, drop a like and a comment and do subscribe to us for more compilations. Seriously, were it not for your encouraging support, we would not have come this far. Until next time, cheers!